In year two under head coach Mike Silva, Nichols baseball is currently first in Southland Conference standings at 12 and 6 with a real shot to win their first regular season conference title in program history. We're at David and a world full of Goliaths on the athletic spectrum, and uh, but that's not an excuse. You know, that's as motivation, and we can go out and still win baseball games against the best. The Colonels had the second best offense in the Southland, averaging eight runs per game. The top pitcher in the conference with the third best staff. They've beaten top ranked LSU and they've won four of their six conference series, including a sweep of last year's Southland Conference champion Southeastern over the weekend. Nichols baseball continues to trend upward as the regular season winds down. You know, these guys are going to show up and compete. I don't know. You know, life's not a storybook, right? And so I don't know what these next couple weekends are going to entail. I know it's going to be a lot of fun. I know our players are going to be ready to play, but we're playing really good teams down the stretch. And so the way I look at it is these are the positions you want to be in the next three weekends, right? This weekend, next weekend, then right into the tournament. You know, we're playing for championships, and that was the goal when we got here, and we're going to continue to uh, we're going to continue to put this program in this position. We don't envision that changing, and so we have to get comfortable and, uh, and just go and play and, do our, and play our game. Nichols last won the Southland Conference Tournament title in 1998. Before they get to the postseason, they have six games left. Two three-game conference series starting Friday with Texas A&M Corpus Christi. They wrap up the season with a three-game series at UNO.